Hello everyone, I'm Lindsay, a member of the Presentec team. As you may know, Presentec is a complete provider of diagnostics and monitoring solutions for industrial networks. Not only are we a PI certified competency center and test lab, but we come with over 20 years in the field, helping keep your industrial networks healthy and reliable 24 seven. Did you know that how and where you do passive monitoring is vitally important? The reason being is, if done through a monitoring port of a switch, you are relying on your switch's capabilities. If your switch is not able to handle a high network load when dealing with real-time applications, the monitor port can be affected, compromising the data you are analyzing. So, how do you solve this issue? You need a component that can access a large amount of data without interfering your network or losing messages. However, a device like this can provide a ton of data. Have you ever seen a message recording from an industrial network? It's huge, it's complicated. You need the proper knowledge, you need to know what you're looking for, and it can take you hours to identify a problem. In today's video, I will show you the simplest and most reliable ways to identify issues on your Profinet and Ethernet IP networks using Percentex's newest solutions. I'll show you the EtherTap, our main component for performing passive monitoring. The Ether Mirror, the perfect component to create a simple measuring point on your networks. And the EtherTap Message Analysis on OSIRIS software, which turns the data into valuable information, allowing you to pinpoint the errors in your network in a matter of seconds. All this in a live operational environment. So, let's get started. A critical network is an industrial network in which a single point of failure could result in failure of the entire production process causing you higher costs. Think of an automotive plant where time is money, where a car must roll out every minute. Customer dissatisfaction. In logistics, having downtime and losing someone's luggage or not sending them their package on time. Causing a waste of resources. Think of batch disposals in chemical and food and beverage industries, consuming excessive energy to restart an entire production process. So for a critical network, we suggest a direct eater tap and Atlas, because this way you get 24-7 permanent passive and active monitoring, helping you prevent costly downtime and avoid the aforementioned. Now, let's take a look at the suggested setup when permanent monitoring is not an option and you have multiple networks. When permanent monitoring is not an option and you have multiple networks, we suggest the Ether Mirror as we have set up over here. Simply explained, the Ether Mirror becomes the permanent access point on a network. It allows the user to plug the Ether tab with the OSIRIS enabled device as and when they need it. For this scenario, we have set up our 7 inch Mercury, but it can also be used in combination with our Mercury 10 inch model or any other device using the OSIRIS software package. So, when having multiple networks, you only need to place the Ether Mirror on each network. Then you can travel with a single Ether tab and OSIRIS device and plug into each network. Want to see how the data is presented? Let's take a look. So once you enable the Ether tab license on your OSIRIS enabled device, you will see a clickable Ether tab tile on your OSIRIS dashboard. If your setup is correct, you will see a green tick on the tile and that the status of the tab says connected. Let's click on the tile. We enter and the first page we see is the Ether tab overview page. On the top right, you can see the status of the Ether tab and the model of the Ether tab that you're using. For the purpose of the video, we're going to do the passive monitoring on a Profinet network. So I will leave the protocol as is. As you can see, the protocol is set here. Depending on the license you are using, you can switch with the protocol drop-down menu. You can switch between Profinet Ethernet and our latest Ethernet IP. Each protocol will show you different information. So here we can see the overall status of the network with the device details chart next to it. If you want to know what you're looking at, remember, you can always click on the question mark icons and Delphi will appear informing of what you're looking at. So firstly, we have a general status of the entire network. The color coded ring here shows us if everything is fine in Percentex traditional stoplight system. This status ring is a summary of the passive information OSIRIS is analyzing. Below, it indicates the last time there was a change in the status and reason. These network details can be seen by switching the view down here. 
you see the number of alarms and dropped packets, percentage of jitter and the minimum and maximum cycle times. The device details chart on the right is a list of devices with all this relevant passive information for each. If you click on a specific network detail on the left, it will filter the information in the chart for you, only showing the specific information. If we click on view from the drop down menu on the upper bar, it's possible to switch to alarms and message recording. Let's click on alarms. Here you are giving a detailed list of all the alarms registered from the device. You see the name of the device, a timestamp of when the alarm occurred, the type of alarm and the category. It's also possible to filter those alarms by selecting the type at the top of the list. By clicking on Delphi, you can see the criteria for each category. Let's now move on to the message recording. This brings up a new window. Here we can set the triggers to record messages when an error occurs. The list indicates the device name, the time step and the type of error occurred. What's really useful is, it uses standard PCAP file format, so you can download the recording after. You can always click the question mark to have more information. This would complete passive analysis of your network. Additionally, when you click report in OSIRIS and fill in the values, you see the either tab analysis of your network included on the report. This can be useful to have if performing any modifications to your network. So that's it. So, in summary, you have now clearly seen the advantages of using Percentex either tap, either mirror, together with our OSIRIS-enabled devices. You now know the importance of passive monitoring and understand the need for reliable setup, especially with a critical network. You've seen the value of information over data with simple clarity on what is happening on your Profinet and Ethernet IP networks. And as a result, you now know what Presentec tools are needed to reduce costly downtime, lower operational cost, and optimize production process. For more detailed information, you are welcome to visit our website and check out our other solutions. Feel free to check out our other videos or sign up for a free webinar. Once again, my name is Lindsay. Thank you for watching. See you next time.